All right, this is Northview girls coach Roy Lazaro. Coach, can you introduce your girls? Uh, yeah, this is Janelle Gozer. She's our one on one a junior year. She's been wrestling three years here for us. And Alexis Garza, okay. also a junior. She's our one on one pounder. She's actually been wrestling for since she was 11 years old. Yeah. So we've kind of come a long way. Um, before we start with the girls, uh, the Northview wrestling family is a, is a legit family. Seeing the Seeing the boys win, does that in any way inspire you guys? Or It does, it does. We consider ourselves a family, like you said, okay. from the little kid program all the way through. I've been coaching the kids program for four years here now, and the boys got started. I went into that room and I yelled, it's our turn now, let's go. Yeah. And they responded right away, right? Coach went crazy. So we have the girls that started and ended the championship. Exactly, yeah. Um, First, before we talk about your two girls, overall, like, how do you feel like the girls wrestled in general? I felt really good coming in. I felt like they matched up really well. Um, there was a couple of surprises. We got pinned when maybe where I didn't think we'd get pinned, but some of our girls pulled through and didn't get pinned. And that's really the key in duels, to fight hard and not give up those six points. Okay. Um, and then the our captains, our, senior, our juniors, our seniors, they all stepped up. My juniors and seniors stepped up today. Okay, so you started the night off, right? with a pin. Can you talk about how exciting that was, how important that was to you to get your team off to a great start? Uh, it was very important because it set the tone for the rest of Absolutely. the Absolutely. And after that, I thought we just got to go Okay. Um, we were just talking off camera about how what your coach said to you. Well, you don't. What did, what did your coach tell you right before you took the mat? Um, to get the legs first. No, about not getting pinned. Like... <laughs> Basically, don't get pinned and we win, right? Yeah. In the bag if you don't yeah. your bag. So, not only did you not get pinned, and in 25 seconds you stuck your opponent. Um, before I ask about that, were you nervous at all knowing that a pin would have tied the match? Or no. Not at all? Okay. Okay. So, but you did close it out quickly. Yes. How exciting was that? It was really exciting to, like, end the end The, the championship? Tour. Yeah. 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 Um, when you went out there, what were your thought? What was your thought process? Obviously, you obviously you said you weren't thinking about not getting pinned, but what were, what was your thought process walking um, out there? Um, that it was my match. Okay. And that I'm gonna get it. Okay. And win it. Did you expect to? I mean, I don't know if you can do that in wrestling. Expect to win in a certain amount of time. Were you surprised at all? Was that quickly? Um. Yeah. Yeah, I was. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, can you talk about the way she started the duel? What did that mean to the rest of you guys? I mean, do you feel like she started the momentum well for you guys? Yes, it, it got our energy up, and yeah. Same thing with you. When you, I mean, obviously you have faith in your girl, but they do close within six points. To see her like not only not lose but pin in such a quick way, what what did that feel like for you guys to know that championships are ours? Uh, it was exciting, especially since last year. You know, everything that happened. Oh, you guys lost to the same team. Yeah. Okay. But it was exciting to know that. This was ours. Yeah. yeah. What was the difference between last year and this year? I think, uh, well, they graduated five girls that okay. they had got that, that they were very, very tough, very, very tough. And we got close last year. We did our best and we, we fell short. But basically, they had a little bit of more mature, talented wrestlers. We were barely sophomores and freshmen. Right now, I have a junior and a sophomore okay. class. And like I said, some of them have been wrestling like six, seven years. Uh, but our maturity, and we're still young. That's the crazy thing. We're still very young. We have two seniors on our team. Okay. Not just in our lineup, but we are, we're a heavy sophomore and junior team. So we're going to keep going with okay. this. We're going to see yeah. what it takes us. We're trying to make a run at state. So last thing, I'm hoping you can all name a different girl. Yeah. Start with you. Who's someone that s stepped up that impressed you tonight that did her, did her job well? Um, I'd probably say Natalie Lopez. At what weight? Uh, 70. Okay. Yeah, I would say Sofia Gomez, wrestling up one of the best girls in the state. At what weight? At uh, 131 pounds. Okay. She wrestled one of the best girls in the state and just gave up a decision. Okay. A close match, actually. I guess it's Sofia, too. Okay. <laughs> yeah, pick a different one. Uh, They're all so close. Yeah. Okay, it's all right. Last question for Coach. Uh, what are you most proud about with this, not just the two girls, but the group? Uh, just that they fight and they believe in what we tell them. They really do believe. Uh, we try to take the pressure off, and, and they do everything we tell us. They, they don't complain. They are wrestlers. 
and, and it's a very tough sport to do this. You know, some people can try to get in there and try and fake it. None of my girls fake it. They get in there, they work hard, they trust the process, and they do everything we ask, and they deserve this championship. Okay. 100%.